And then it's so hard to gauge because people are folding trips on the river and f***ing not betting ace-king, but then some people are just absolutely ruffling it off. Yeah, I'm going to call the four bet here. And get stuck. Do you like getting stuck? If I just shove, I mean, versus that size, I have to shove, right? Villain does call with his kings. We're going to run it once and hopefully drill it. That's partly drilling it. Can we hold? No, eight, five, or king, please, dealer. Get wrecked, sir. Uh, this guy calls a check raise, bats the turn, and then checks the river. And uh, we have a full house, which is good. Nice, nice little sick out there. We like to see that. Uh, okay, a little peasant size here. Three bat, so we're going to call with ace nine suited. Flop top pair. We will call and see a turn. Turn check. We're going to check back and bat like every river versus check. I think fish are generally, I mean, maybe not, but with the sizing from big blind, they're generally quite polar. So I expect them to have a lot of kings, queens, jacks type hands, and maybe they will just put us on a miss club draw and call. We'll see. Kings. Same thing. Talov. Here we defend. Um, so we were playing heads up, so we ended up having the button. So he raised, we called, we call flop, call turn versus small size. And hmm. Do I want to call the river here? Is the question. What uh I need to have a club, so do I just call 10-9 with the ten of clubs? What's his sizing about? Um we're going to call this sometimes. I don't think I can just call flushes, right? I think 10-9 with a club, we're going to call. And then everything else we fold. Love to see it. Honestly, as well, I genuinely think that people just do that size when they have the ace of clubs way more often than they actually balance with the nut flush as well. Because people are just like, well, I need them to fold, so I'm going all in. Here, we three back, we get check raised. We're going to call with this hand. And hate life on the turn. Yeah, calling versus this size, we can still improve as well. So how about the ten of spades? It's a six of spades, you misheard me. And yeah, check back. I mean, I guess we lose, right? Pretty often. Yeah, jacks, that makes sense. Really fucking annoying that he finds the turn bet with that hand as well. <laughs> jacks with no diamond, because I like think about what I'm actually calling with. I'm not really sure about the sizing, but uh am I just gonna fucking absolutely rifle this off? There's a good chance. Uh, yeah, block some two pairs now as well. And he has some 8x of hearts and 8x of hearts as well as 7x of clubs. So I'm going to rifle this one off. Uh, block 5-6, which is nice. Block ace-4, which is nice. Um, and yeah, main value here is 7s, 8s, and ace-8 suited. Really good spot and a good board to, to rifle this one, I think. And a good hand. But people might just be like, well, two flush draws missed. He's got a flush draw. And it's like, well, nice, let's get it through. Here, we're going to go for the check raise on turn. We check call flop. We're going to go check raise on turn. And I guess I kind of have to blast this river. We're just going to go part. I'm not really thrilled about bluffing this fella, but. Nice, we actually get it through. What's this? We're just fucking just catching bluffs, bluffing left, right, and center. I'm not even recording this as well, which is really annoying. Guess I can um, can download it. 
Uh, turn a flush draw, easy call versus this size. And hopefully we river a heart. We do. We have the second nuts. And he checks back, so we can't run into the nuts, which is really nice. And gives up sixes like a funny. Uh, here, turn goes check, check. Uh, we're going to bet big on river. You can still have ace king. You can have some aces, but a lot of the time we're just going to have the best hand. Picking up the kings. We've been three bets. We are going to four bets. Going to make sure I run it twice is on. It's all in. Please hold. There's one. There's two. It's another $2,000 part. Uh, we open queen seven suited BVB. I did want to just bat this board, but I think this hand just much prefers check calling. Spade on the turn is fun. How about the ace of spades on the rimmer? I wonder if I'll have leads on the ace of spades. Uh, not against this guy, so I'm going to check 100% of rivers. So I'm not even going to. I'm not even going to look at the river. I'm just going to. I'm just going to check because I don't think I'm going to lead on a single river. And hopefully we've just drilled the spade. Hopefully we've drilled the ace of spades. Oh, yeah, Jack of Diamonds. Not that, not the card we're after. Just have to fold now as well. It's literally the worst card in the deck. Um, I do think this guy looks really fucking aggressive. He looks like he's absolutely just going off on one, but I'm not calling Queen 7 of spades here. Yeah. Really bad combo to call. I'm not blocking anything good. Bags all over the place, mate. This was uh, this was Dan's, Dan's doing, I think. So you want to play tournaments after the big win? Ah, shit. Uh, I mean, he shoves jacks, he might shove queens. I, I fucking... Uh, let me figure out what I'm going to do. I want to call this some of the time, I think. Yeah, Harold will call. Okay. Flipping. Ah, running it once, though. Not that it makes much of a difference. Ten. Uh, maybe I could just fold. I don't know. Does he? I, I don't know if he does shove queens. I don't know. Uh, this guy leads the flop. Um, in a single raise part. Shitty run out. I don't think he's gonna have many. Like what? Eight x does he have? Eights? Does he even do this with eights? Just against a whale, I think I'm going to have to call, but I expect to lose a lot. Um, having the queen of clubs isn't ideal here, but... I don't think I'm folding against this guy. Yeah. So fucking sick. As if he's back called the flop and the turn, and then just gets that river. I think I'm going to raise this hand versus call up or fold here, yeah. I'm going to raise and get this in. <clears throat> Leave myself enough to to shove a turn and have some fold equity. Lovely. Uh, here we three bet each jerk. Check check on flop. We are going to check turn. And I guess fire really big on river. And take it down. Maybe I could have folded out some river. Wish I had a shove so I could have folded. Two power with a seven pot. Uh, here, I'm going to... I check Rose flop. I'm going to bet pot on the turn and probably give up on river. Nice. Go study, bro. Oh, shut the fuck up, mate. <laughs> what was wrong with what I did? Literally nothing, you funny. 
Uh, right, Ivy Carla, shut up for a minute, mate. I didn't ask. All right, we've got aces. We've been three, bat. We're going to four, bat. Hopefully, he's going to go all in. He goes all in. Nice. We're queens. Can we hold? Queen of hearts. <laughs> I was feeling. Uh, I knew it was gonna be. I knew it was gonna be a uh, Broadway. This guy. <laughs> this guy probably peeled it out slow and thought he drilled it. <laughs> uh, Tans here. Uh, okay. I am gonna bang this in. I'm on a ninety nine. It's probably not a thing, but this guy looks like a fish. This guy's opening too wide. This guy will squeeze a lot here. Twenty big blinds in the middle, and I rolled a ninety nine. So we're going to go for it. Nah, surely the big blind can't wake up or something. That would have been unfair. Nice. Uh, here, this is a three bet part. I'm going to bet the turn. Goes check, check. He checks flop pretty quickly. So I'm going to try and induce here. Um, and do this. And if he has a flush, it's just really annoying. Because I'm not going anywhere. It works so often to induce, man. Honestly, you have no idea. Just bet really small. People are like, okay. And money raises that quick as well. I was, I was going to say, I should have taken more time and just said that, yeah, he never has it here. Induce, induce, induce. That's absolute ego in the way that, like, well, yeah, I'm not, like, he's not even got a fucking heart, man. Like, come on. Uh, picking up jacks here. I think we ISO or raise and we go three way. I'm just going to do this. Sort of targeting. The whale here, mainly. Okay, he calls. Uh, they both call. King on the turn, I'm going to bet small. Here, I'm just going to start putting lots of money in. Uh, we turn top set. Super wet board, though. Loads that's going to continue, so we're going to bet here. Um, hopefully, he's got something like King Tan. And his deados. Uh, okay, I'm gonna raise, but I don't know what size. I don't know with the board if I just want to shove. Shove feels just very egregious. But min raise just it gives him a good price. Fuck it, we'll just basically click it. I think our hand is too good to shove. <clears throat> I don't want to call with the amount of hands that can continue here. He shoves with 9-5. Don't you do this. Jesus Christ, can you imagine? Can you actually imagine? Guys, that is an $800 pot of real money. Hello. You get the special green tag, buddy, for excellent play. Agtard is just somebody that's willing to just put in a lot of money with fucking nothing. So, like, the guy that uh, 5x pot shoved with ace high earlier, like, he gets the Agtard. Oh, my God, look how deep we are. I should have 3-bet this because we're so deep. Well, that was so disappointing. Call a 3-bet here a little bit loosely, and I'm just going to be all in. Ooh, interesting. Yeah, call and turn, and then I guess I just have to fucking bah blast every river. But if it's like the two of spades, it's just going to suck. Not the two of spades. I don't want him to shove, though. If he shoves, he, he probably wins, so I need him to check. I mean, does he shove, like, aces here with the diamond? I think we might lose. Oh, my... Wait, what? Nah, this guy's multi-accounting. That's not Galameo. That's not Galameo. Galameo doesn't 3-bet A7 off and triple barrel bluff. No, 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 no. Somebody's using his account, boys. Somebody's using his account. Fucking not having that. Are you mad? Jesus Christ. Or has he grown up from the amount of times I've called him a fucking stain on stream? Look at this. I'm even going to upgrade his tag. You watch him, buddy. Bravo. You're an adult. Uh, pretty loose, but this guy's 3-bet. 3-4 um, suited, so I want to play this hand in position with him. 
against them. I believe that's all kinds of shit. I'm gonna I'm gonna play some FTO shit here on Cold Caller Three, but to get an A side board punished for it. What do you mean fold? I clicked it, bro. Yeah, this is a nine. So I did this in in the hope that he would shove here because I've seen him do some fucking retarded stuff with shoving. So I expected him to have a lot of shoves when he continued. Uh, check check on flop at least. We will bet on turn. This is check. This guy, like, what the fuck are you doing here, buddy? Well, I guess I just shove versus bet, right? Do I? I mean, how else can I ever have the nut blocker here? Such a weird hand. I'm not going to cold call three bets again. Uh, he's got no time bank, so he'll call. Ah, oh, sweet. <laughs> but so many, so many fucking people just like just end up calling when they have no time bank. Come on, give the juicer. Give the juicer. Ooh, sixes. That is a juicer. <laughs> I mean, you know, sixes flop sets, boys. You know sixes flop sets. We'll gamble. We're flipping. Come on, no ace or six. <sighs> Thought it was the ace. Boom, 412 big blind pot. We didn't even flop a set with sixes. Boom, you love to see it, man. Easy game. Oh, hello. Um, what size am I going here? I don't know. This'll do. Ah, oh, fuck, he's got 34 big blinds. I should have. Pay attention, Mark. Okay, well, roll in anyway. Kings and nines, uh, no king, and ideally no nine, but definitely no king. Uh, I've been four bet and I've got queens, I'm just going to shove here. You see them both play out. Okay, we take it down with queens. We go back to aces. Just needs to fade a king or a nine for a 235 big blind pot. Hello. Hello. Sometimes poker's easy. Nick, I'm sorry, buddy. This table's not even on you, not bad, Mark. Oh, you better believe I'm double floating, though. Langdon. I need to sit out again. Honestly, I can't. I can't fucking focus at the minute. Uh, so we're gonna go. We're gonna go call, call, and then you know what? what you know what's gonna happen on a club. You, you know what's gonna happen on a club. Do you know what's gonna happen on a club? Do you know what's going to happen on a club? Uh, I'm trying to think what size I want about here. Yeah, I'm going to go very slightly over par. Right, I've got some thank yous to do. So I'm going to set out. I could shove, but I don't really shove that many hands here, to be honest. So I was kind of hoping he'd bat the river so I can call flop, call turn, and then shove versus a bat. Because we actually have more fold equity then, because we represent an even stronger range. Nice, we'll get it through. Uh, here, what's going on? We're calling the three bat. Bit annoying because we're out of position. Mike's over here, and then we get stacked. Oh, damn. Uh, our hand's so good it can raise, but I just like to be a bit more passive on these boards. Uh, I'm going to go for the check, check, check. So even if he checks turn, I'm probably going to check river as well. I, I get lost to MTTs every now and then anyway. Kind of want to raise against this size because I think you'll see hands like eights and stuff do this. I fucking hope it's not eights. Seven. Si He's not just checked back seven high, has he, boys? He's not. He's not. Can I raise this? We bet flop, check back turn, we go three way. 
King Queen should always three bat. King Jack he could have. What are we trying to target? Like King Nine? Yeah, I figured we just got the fold a lot. Right, we call the three bats with Ace Four suited. And if he bats very big here, I think we can only just shove, right? <clears throat> I think we have some shoves here, even versus half part. Maybe not. I'm going to shove, though, because there is actually a world where he calls with worse hands. Am I going to run things twice at 400? Not sure if this is a thing. I think we'll have shoves versus... I think he's supposed to bet bigger. I think he's supposed to bet, like, um... Three quarters on that board. Like big battle check. I don't know. Don't know, mate. Uh, check raise of the diamond on a high roll. All right, I got loads of spots. I got aces at 400. I've got ace five suited. Do I just three bet this? Goes check check on flop. Oh, I've been four bet. Nice. I'm out of position. I'm just going to rip it. Nice, we got called by Jacks. Hold it, baby. Ah, fuck, I don't know what to do with deuces here. Just called. No Jack. Okay. Yeah, I know I should have three about a turn. Aces. What the fuck? No Jack. Boom. Aces. Checks back. Min raises turn. I knew I should have fucking three about the turn. God damn it. I was in the middle of a hand here. Fucking hell. Up to a 1k stack, though. Jesus Christ. What's going on here? Uh, I've checked like a fanny here. I think the heart is particularly bad to barrel on as well when it's gone like this. Because so. um, you'll have a lot of ace-x. Like you can have like ace-10, jack-10, jack-9 of hearts, all of which check back the turn in order to realize that equity. And yeah, I've just I've just limped 9-5 off suit. Working 9-5. to five. I'm really pissed off about that 9 hand. I should 3 bet. But I don't know what the fuck he's doing checking the river. Uh, hello. What is his turn sizing? Uh, it's called shit, mate. That's what it is. Ten six offsuit. suit. I guess we're all in. What would your best guess be? I have no idea. You're asking the wrong guy about win rates, man. I don't know if, what games I'm profitable in, what games I'm not profitable in. You have to understand that everything you do at the poker table conveys information. You have to understand that now I do things for content reasons, basically. So, like, I play... Rush for content. I play 1k and L for content. Like, I don't know if I'm winning. I don't know what my win rate is. And part of me doesn't really care, to be honest. Go on, then. Yeah, that's a weird river, mate. That's a weird one. Check could be all right. Check could be really all right. What the fucking hell are you talking about, son? So I guess his bluff should be ace queen suited. This is retarded. How do you have a five? And how do you have a queen? You're not just like double floating and, j and jamming, are you? All right, I'm gonna fold here. Maybe that combo's fine. I don't know. And I'm gonna call here and expect to lose to quads, but what quads? Yeah, there we go. I thought he was going for the double flow. I'm fucking so good at this game. You're an idiot, man. Imagine trying to bluff the best to ever do it. I have played, I have made so many insanely good decisions in the past two days. It has been absolutely ridiculous. Absolutely fucking ridiculous. Look at this, we've got four streamers on one table. This should be a plus 80. Gizzard juicer. <laughs> fucking 5-3 off, man. All right, Queenus, thank you for the gifted sub. Oh, it's a silver spade, Sage. Welcome back. Uh, we'll bet the turn and then probably... I'm just going to take the piss with this if he's 4 in. Yeah, we're going to check the river, I think, with this. Uh, this guy's a whale. King 5. Chop, 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 chop. Probably just bet bigger here. That is a nice turn. That's not a nice river. That's a fucking horrible river. I need to see ace queen or ace jack that should have folded. Or ace ten that should have folded. It's out there. It was nice of him.
Check call or check raise. I'll see what I'm in the mood for. I oh, big size though. We'll, we'll just call on this. Is that so? And then call the turn ski. Uh, okay. Don't bite you knob. Okay. So we lose the three axe, but we beat everything else basically because he's not. He, he doesn't really have a lot that wants to battle on that river then. No. Apart from like nine axe of part. Well, just nine axe because he can have some random nine it. He is a fun one. Question is, do I fire the third barrel? I think the answer's got to be yes with this hand, but I kind of don't want to. Uh... Yeah, I'm firing. I'm just trying to figure out what size. I don't think I like shove, so I think we'll do this. But I think some people think this size looks bluffy. I can't not fire this this river. I don't think. With this hand. And the longer he takes, the more likely he is to call in this circumstance, I think, when the board's like this. Because people look for uh, excuses to call rather than reasons to fold, in my opinion. From my experience, uh, we'll get called light. Told you. The thing is, I don't know if he's a fish or not. I can just assume he's a fish, but... Oh my god. Reasonable. Reasonable flop. Reasonable turn. I might even just shove here. Nah, I can't really shove. Ooh, that's a nasty one, actually. As queens as possible. Kings, nice. I should just shove the turn. Uh, nice, easy game. I think he can have deuces here. I think I have to call because I think he's so he raised flop versus small bat, and I think he can have king jack. I should probably bluff this, but I really should bluff this. I mean, <laughs> nice, <laughs> nice, King Jack. The thing is, what if he doesn't fold deuces? What if he calls deuces, man? It'd be so tilting. Right, we got to bluff through at least. What the fucking hell has happened here? Why is the fifteen big blinds in the pot? What has gone on? Uh, really clever bluff, though, with aces, Mark. Very clever. Very well played. I should raise this. I'm going to fanny out there. Should have got two streets of value. I was too busy with the other fucking hand. <laughs> it's just it's so confusing. So confusing that you're playing like a knobhead. <laughs> Quite possibly the worst. No, I don't think the spade makes a difference. It depends as well, because... People just think, like, oh, not having a spade is good, but, like, I don't really bluff with spades. The point is that we want him to have spades. Ooh, fun one here. Fucking hell, I keep flapping set. Uh, yeah, gonna have to double. I mean, I might have to fucking triple this, to be honest. Okay, not on a spade. But I've got jack high. But what's really gonna fold? Queen Jack of Diamonds. Actually, having clubs is really bad here because he can have... Um, I've just been three back with my set of jacks. Let me just set out. Yeah, I think... Uh, I'll talk about that hand in a second. I think that having clubs or diamonds is really, really bad here. Hearts is, is better. Uh, I guess I want a jack. If he has aces, it's just not okay. Hopefully he ha actually hopefully he has King Queen with the with the King of Hearts and Fires for a laugh, but just have King Queen of Hearts, buddy. King Queen of Hearts probably shouldn't do it. King Nine of Hearts should, but don't have aces or deuces. That'd be dumb. We know he's shoving. 
obviously. What a fucking absolute fucking... God damn it, man! Do you even shove a flush on the river? Fuck off, man. Ah, uh, dear. Snap shove. Think maybe call. Hmm. Has he ever shoved some daft shit? Like nines? Does he ever tilt like... Yeah, fine. Fine. Yeah. Oh, hello. Hello. No queen. Oh my god, I flopped a set as well. What do you mean nines? No queen. I got a bad feeling I'm going to lose this. I got, I got a feeling I'm going to lose it. No king or queen. Nice. Right. <laughs> Fucking, come on. Moan it in, boys. Oh, let me laugh at this guy, actually. I've got him tagged as a... Quack. I don't know why, so... Get Rex on. Um, turn is uh, a three, and the river is a king, and then we go all in. Now, if I lose this, I'll be pretty fucking pissed off. Bluffs will be hands like seven, eight suited of every suit you can imagine. And then I guess we'd have to get fruity with some fucking, uh, like, queen jack of spades and stuff like that, so. Do you have a lot of family money or something, bro? I'm the most working class guy you've ever fucking seen. Every penny that I have made, I have made from nothing. In fact, my entire bankroll comes from fucking free rolls. From free rolls and determination. And run good at trying. I feel like I might be getting slow rolled by quads. What do we think, boys? Maybe he's trying to snipe, actually. Uh, I don't know how long my delay is. It should be enough to cover it. I think I upped it by five seconds. Queens. Okay, yeah, we should be good. How the fuck has he folded a king? Why is he folded a king? What the fuck? What on earth? No, my delay isn't long enough, surely. I think we can maybe have small bets on here. Right, I think I missed some shit anyway. Right, listen, my 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 three night with the prime. Thank you very much, dude. Welcome, welcome to the borough. Appreciate it. This is so weird. I mean, they'll probably just have ten jack, right? But how can I not bluff this? Uh, I don't think I can call as well because they still have some uh, value bets that aren't that hand. So nice. Well. We need him to just have kings if we want to. <laughs> no, it's absolute waste of space. <laughs> so I think calling here is the best play in general against Nick. So let's see if he's got it in him to, to fall back blow. Let's see if he's got it in him. No, of course he doesn't. Fine, he's a streamer. We'll run it twice and probably get punished on the second. Yeah, I fucking knew it. Should have just run it fucking once. Especially against Nets, man. Uh, I'm really fucked off at that because I just always run it once at 200. But I was like, ah, oh, I'll be nice. But like, why? Like, literally, why? For what reason? Uh, we turn the nut straight. But there is a flush on board. That's a really annoying river. Sweet. Eight high. <laughs> it's no good. The fuck is happening with everybody today, man, honestly. Anyway, I think this is a good hand to check. I think Ben's fine. He'll have some five out. Got a flush. I'm not going to lose. Do I want to check raise against Phil? I don't know if I can against over, but... I mean, I guess he has 5x, but does he... I mean, that's weird. Imagine I raise and he shoves, though. Right, well, you wouldn't. Uh, right, we check raise flop. We're going to pot turn, and then... Um... Three quarters river, ten percent river, third river. I have no idea what is best to do here. I 
something like this, but I'm really not sure. I wonder, like, especially with the straight coming in on turn as well. If he shoves here, we probably just, um, we either be ace nine with the ace of spades or we lose. I mean, he can have, he should have queen ten of spades. No, queen ten of spades should fall turn. <laughs> Actually, just don't bluff in this game. There, there is literally. What the fuck does he think I've got? Check, raise the flop, bet the turn, bet the river on that board. And call this a big blind. Can I float? Can I float? Might be a bit loose. Well. King of Diamonds. Ugh. <laughs> I mean, I would say I assume he's bluffing with Ace King with the Ace of Spades, but this guy's Ukrainian, so I don't I don't think they're allowed to bluff, are they? Show the bluff. Oh <laughs> with no spade! <gasps> Oh my god, he went full retard. Oh my god, he actually just went full retard. That is insane. Oh my god. Like, think about it. Like, with the size as well, uh, pre flop and then flop, I just have all of the nut flush drawers and like second nut flush drawers. Like, I, oh, I have every single ace of spade combination uh, in my range. Oh my god. Nice value, nice value shove on the river, though. To be fair, I, I was, I, like, I was confident he was bluffing there as well. This is, he's literally there are a hundred percent chance that this guy is in the stream and he's like, I'm going to show people that Ukrainians aren't nits. Like people's ego get in the way, man. They're like, no, 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 we're not nits. Look at this. Look what I'm going to do. And then it's so hard to gauge because people are folding trips on the river and fucking not betting ace king, but then some people are just absolutely ruffling it off with fucking no blockers, with nothing. They're just like, well, you've got this guy. This was all it. You've got what? I got the nuts. Uh, I don't have the nuts, but I still have the best hand. I don't think I can not have the best hand here. I'd be unbelievably surprised if I didn't. Yeah. I'm going to call two streets with this 8 9. I think this guy will uh, double barrel way too much. Might even call the river, to be honest. Yeah, I want to see a shove when he does shove. Um, block some, some of his strongest hands. Like, does he ever shove king-queen here? I don't think so. So I don't think he shoves... Maybe he shoves king-queen, but he's not shoving, like... He shouldn't be shoving, like, queen-10 and stuff like that, queen-jack. So he's pretty polar, and we unblock, like, everything, basically. All the 10-jack, king-10, king-jack, stuff like that. Uh, clubs, all kinds of shit. So I think this is a pretty good hand to call down with. Expect to see sevens and, like, aces here, specifically. So I'd... I'd if he does bluff on rivers, then I think he's going to have an abundance of bluffs and too many bluffs and not enough uh, value. And I like blocking pocket nines as well and queen nines suited. So. Yeah, nice. Uh, and if he's bluffing a pair as well, he's probably bluffing too much. So, uh, Come on. Got a feeling about this one. Wait, was this the guy that fucking blasted it with... No, it's not, it's not the same Ukrainian, is it? Hello. We've flopped two pair, as many as two. So he can actually have us like in really bad shape here. I don't think I want to raise and get this in because like I can't get 170 bigs in on this board and on a lot of turns and be a favorite. So I think just calling, allowing bluffs. I guess hope for a five or a six on the river. So I think Ace King is like mm, if Ace King checks, it's annoying, but it also gives him room to bluff hands like Ace Jack, Ace Ten, and stuff. So don't have Ace King. Honestly, if you're not going to bluff that, why the fuck are you playing? You're just literally just like... A Ukrainian? A nit? No, you're joking. You're joking. I'm going to pop this king six. Oh my god, I flopped quad sixes. 
Quad, quad, quad sixes. Down here, we're extremely polar, so we're about like, I'm going to pot or check. I think checking is, I should actually probably check with no kicker. <laughs> okay. That's why I see that as well. I know, I know we're going to get raised on this board load. Uh, over bat, okay. Whatever will I do with my quads? Uh, River comes an 8 down here, which I don't think he's going to have that many of, but just calling, and then do we slow roll? <laughs> he could have 8-9 eight, of, uh, of diamond. Well, it's all of. I mean, that run out, he's got a blast by the end of it, but like, okay. So I'm going to be in a world of hurt if I get jammed on here. Oh my god. Is he really trying to get me to fold a seven? I, I have no better hands apart from... Do I even have a7? I don't know if this is the knit tag or the fucking station tag. <clears throat> uh, I think... I, I think... I, like, I want to fold here. But I'm genuinely just really worried about him showing me a bluff. But I think folding's fine. But, I mean, what are you even going to fucking value shove there? 